the mermaid the mermaid's voice returns in this one by amanda lovelace and and this one you get a forward by lang leave and this is her uh final one in the women or some kind of magic trilogy and she does have a few contributors so at the back it says contributors in order of appearance and it tells you what poem they did and some of their um, social media handles and so uh, like her other ones it's categorized um, contents um, into ones that are kind of like related to this one so this is like kind of aerial Little Mermaid kind of inspired. So you got the sky, the shipwreck, the song, the surviving. And so you do get like purple colored font and you do get her same kind of style set up of poetry and a lot of white space, especially when doing these types of poetry. Uh, the one that I bookmarked for myself um, is it's one of the like paragraph ones for my childhood friend for some reason um, I I bookmarked that one so and like this is this one I that was the only poem that I flagged um, for me to like easy access her other two books i've liked more than <laughs> um about six to ten poems in each one so but like the poems are still good this one completely fills the page but there are some pretty nice poems in here and I just like the purple, so you got white, black, and purple covering for her poetry collections. And it's nice that she um, brought in like other poets, and I liked how they merged together really well with her, her poems. Because sometimes when you put like put a collection together or you have con um, contributors, it's a little it's like you can feel the varying voices and this one you don't really like to me i didn't really feel that so really nice and yeah the mermaid's voice returns in this one happy readings